guys, this is Sarah with the Today Paper Co. and I am coming to you today with my monthly plan with me for May 2017. I am going to be using a kit from Peekaboo Planning and I am actually one of her PR girls so if you like this kit and you want to order it from her, use my code. It's a date. 20 to save 20% on this kit or your entire order whatever you decide to get and you also get a really cool freebie I don't have one with me right now but it is actually a mermaid freebie and it is so cute so definitely go and check that out I am going to go ahead and get started I did have a haul earlier this week so you have seen what this looks like I have the May Right here we have some different icons and we have the 2017 and we have some little boxes there. Then we have some full boxes. We have a Happy Mother's Day. We have some holidays across the top here. And then we have some date dots and our sidebar. So I'm gonna go ahead and just get started on May and show you everything here. I love this kit. It is so cute. The um, Slothful Day was actually the Traveler's Notebook freebie that I had last month that I picked and I just thought it was so, so gorgeous and precious. So um, I hope y'all were able to get one of those and she also has a Slothful Day full kit as well which is also gorgeous. I hauled it in the same haul that I hauled this one and I definitely think that you should go and check out her shop if you haven't already and if you have and you like her stickers keep in mind this is so cute and you should definitely go and check it out like don't you love my little weird voice that I just did right there yeah anyway so I am having issues laying this down because I can't get it to go down straight so I'm gonna try turning it upside down the way that I do on my weekly spreads and do it from bottom to top and see if if that helps any so forgive my craziness and of course I ended up with a bubble in it because that's just how it's going apparently for this all right sorry about that guys isn't it so cute with little sloths I think um Leslie with run with craft scissors said that she had given her this idea and I think it is such a good idea and it's just like the little sloths and it's kind of like the mama and the baby sloths for Mother's Day since Mother's Day is the month of may or in the month of may so and she raised a valid point i watched one of her videos she raised a valid point that you know not all mamas have daughters and a lot of times those are the kits that you see is basically the mama daughter ones so you know i mean i think it's a good idea to definitely um you know do a kit that's not necessarily gender specific so and that way it'll work for all mamas so Anyway, and I know Jessica with Peekaboo Planning as well. She has two sons and a daughter, so yeah. But anyway, um, she also has a Facebook group, and if you're not already in there, you get some special freebies by being in the Facebook group. So hint, hint, nudge, nudge. You should definitely go and check that out as well on peekaboo planning and then of course follow me on facebook instagram twitter all of those basically to learn when my when deals are with peekaboo planning since i am one of the peer girls like i said my code is it's date 20 to save you some money so definitely go and check that out and I'm going to go ahead and let's see, Mother's Day is the 14th. I do actually have a bill due on the 14th, but it'll actually probably, hmm, don't know, let me think. Let's see here. So pretty. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and do the sidebar. Oh, I love that she has it in two pieces here. And my normal turn it around because otherwise it doesn't get lined up right because I apparently can't. If the, I just see it better this way, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, so do 
do any of y'all have any fun plans for the month of May or any Mother's Day plans coming up that you're excited about? I know for us, we're probably going to be all over the state because our family lives from literally basically top to bottom. So anyway, that will be fun. And then, okay, so on the previous one, I didn't know when Ramadan was, but apparently it's on the 27th. So... Or it may come after this. I don't know when everything is actually going to be going up. So we have a Cinco de Mayo. Which actually, I think I'm going to stick it up. No, that's on a Friday. I'm going to stick it in the middle because payday should be there as well. And I think I'm going to use just this little dollar sign. Guys, for payday. And I covered up part of... No, I didn't. Okay, yay. Ah, click it. Anyway, so yeah, I don't know that we have any plans for Cinco de Mayo. I know for, like I said, Mother's Day, we are probably going to be a little bit of everywhere because my husband's family lives down south about an hour and a half. My family lives up north about an hour, about two hours really, and to the west about an hour. So we are some of everywhere. So, yeah. But it's always fun to spend time for holidays and see your family and everything. We actually lived in Texas for five years where it was pretty much just the two of us. We didn't really have family there with us. And it has been great having family around. Especially, like, my husband's family. They take us on little vacations and you know, we get to go see them and talk to them and things. I, re I really enjoy it. So, um, I know on the 4th, I have a dentist appointment. And on the 2nd, I have a doctor's appointment. So, I'm going to go ahead and mark those. Right there. And then, oh, that's Teacher Appreciation Day. And let's see. So, actually, no, a few teachers. I hope y'all feel appreciated that day. And then let's go in and do Bill Do. Hmm. I wasn't going to do this a little bit differently. Let's see here. Hmm. So I guess I'm going to do just bill due right here. Because I was going to do like the bigger deal bills like mortgage and stuff. But there's actually two bills due that day. So let's see. And then I have bill due on not that day. No. And I put that on the wrong day. Ha! Yay. Okay. So, let's do, and actually, mm -mm. let's stick it towards the middle. And then, this day, I was just going to do these little, I guess, kind of washy, kind of towards the middle. Okay, and then there's nothing on the third. There's no bills on the fourth. The fifth is going to be one of the more basic ones. So I will stick it kind of across the middle. And then, of course, it's off center. I try not to do that, but I will say this. These stickers peel up amazingly because I've had to peel up quite a few tonight. So if you like stickers that are easy, hint, hint, nudge, nudge, because they are easy. I'll do that right there. And then let's see, we have water bill. That's going to be a bigger one. Or like, you know, one of the ones that's like in every month and doesn't go away at some point once I get it paid off. And then we'll do the tenth. And I think I'm just going to stick them like together on one. 
page because that's pretty big and then the 11th is a bigger bill and a smaller bill so let's do this one kind of towards the top and then do this one towards the middle right there okay and then we have let's see we have a smaller one on the 12th and nothing should be on the 13th i know the 14th is one of the smaller ones but i can actually probably because they're due two days apart and it's the same place basically just one's my husband's one's mine so i'll do that actually up on the 14th and then the 15th is a bigger one and a smaller one so we'll do that one and because that's actually my car loan which i don't see a car anywhere on there so we'll do that and then we have another smaller one on the let's see on the 17th no that's the 18th Let's see here 18th and then I think on the 19th 21st there's nothing again until the 24th and that's one of the bigger ones that should be our water bill so let's see here 24th and then the 26th is three so I'll stick that right there and I'll just write all three of them in. And then the 27, let's see here. I have the 24th, yeah, that was the. And then we have the 28th and the. That's it. So the 28th will go right here so and let's see I'm trying to see about the sidebar she has these wonderful little sidebar stickers to kind of stick in there so I'm trying to see what I want to do so I already have goals in the others let's do to do across here Let's do, um, let's see, let's do, make it more of a big to-do list, but just put notes in there, and then don't forget, right there, and important, so, they can all be kind of different, but they're all kind of the same thing, so that is pretty much everything on that i will go ahead and on the days that i don't have anything just kind of randomly stick some stuff in so we'll do this on the 30th and then oh yeah we do have the holidays we have let's actually move that over since it's a holiday right there so and we'll do Memorial Day kind of in the center of it and then mm, may the fourth be with you let's see if I can pull up this doctors and I'll put it on top of it so let's do a lighter one so I can write on it and do that and stick in the doctor's appointment and may the fourth be with you like that but towards the bottom and then that I think is 
all of those. So let's see here. We'll do a darker one here on the 13th. And then let's see. Do the 17th. Just trying to randomly pick days. So we'll do the eighth. Right there. And maybe the twenty third. And then let's do the 25th. Let's, well, no, that doesn't really make a huge difference. Okay, so I'll write the bills in after I'm done filming, but I am going to go ahead and I don't have any other decos that I need to use. I'm going to go ahead and do the date dots, which the second just kind of came out on me. So I'm probably going to fast forward through this part or just skip it and come back to it. So we shall see. All right, guys, all of the date dots are in and all of the bills are listed and written down. So I am done with this spread for now. And of course, I'll be adding things as the month goes through. So I hope that you enjoyed this. I loved this kit. It was absolutely amazing. The stickers filled up really well because I kept making mistakes. It had plenty of little... Uh, I guess quarter boxes and bill dues and everything. I like it's kind of a little bit more simple. It's not kind of all over the place, but it covers up quite a bit. It's really beautiful, really pretty. So if you don't already have a May kit, go and get this one. It is amazing. And use my code, it's a date 20 in order to save 20%. And again, this is with Peekaboo Planning. Everything will be linked down below as well. So, and if you have not bought an Erin Condren before and you're interested, there's a link down below that'll save you $10 as well. And and it'll give me a $10 credit so that I can buy more wonderful Erin Condren stuff for this channel to review for you and to use and to show you, you know, different videos. So definitely go and check all of that out. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. If you haven't already checked me out on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, it's all It's a Date Paper Co. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe down below. What you waiting for? There's a lot of fun planner related videos here on this channel. I hope you are all having a wonderful day. I hope you have a wonderful blessed month of May and we will talk soon and have a happy Mother's Day, Memorial Day and a fun Cinco de Mayo as well. So we'll talk soon. Bye guys.